Hi everyone, my name is Bo Hao Chen. I'm a developer for West One project. Today, I'm going to talk about how to add a new poll. Let's open the website. At a, at a right button, you can see we have poll here for people to vote. Now I'm going to teach you how to add a new poll there. Let's go back to CMS. Then let's click polls. So you've already got three polls here. We right click create. Then we give the name to the poll. Remember the name of the polls is actually the the question of the polls you are going to appear on the website. So uh, let's say, do you like a new website? Question mark. Then we click create. Um, you can leave the info as empty. And if we want to this poll to appear on the website, we have to click its latest. Yes, because if we don't click it, then this poll is going to appear in other place rather than the home page. Then we save and publish. And another thing is that you have to find out the the current latest polls and to uncheck the yes. So this is the the current one. We are going to uncheck yes. Um, so this poll becomes the the old polls. Then we save and publish. But we haven't done yet because there is no vote option for this post. So we right click the question and create the answer for this post. Um, the first option is yes, I do like. Then we give the initial counter for this code for this answer. Um, usually, by default, we give zero to the vote. Then we give the poll another option. No, it's ugly. Create. Then zero vote. Save and publish. Then let's go back to the home page. Then we refresh it. Now you can see this is the latest poll we just added. If the user clicked yes, I do like. Now you see. It's become 100%. You can also click the few other results to see the old post results. For this old one. Then let's go back to CMS. When we click yes, I do like option, then you might notice that the vote become one because I clicked yes, I do like, but for no, it, it remains zero.